evening, friends. President Mohanlal, DGND and District Secretary Dr. Elizabeth Chenier, Zone Governor and Sham AG Rajesh, Zone Secretary Prashant, your Club Secretary Mohan Chandramo. More and more otherwise, it doesn't look like a farm. <laughs> Others who have come here, you know, A.G. Bharat, A.G. Vijay Kumar, District Director Pune Gowda, and my Star Walker Presidents, Vashwara, Shiv Kumar, Radhi, Chandresh, and you look Chandresh, I have to look twice to recognize you and eh? to wait here. Wonderful past presidents of this old, old club. Wonderful Rotarians, wonderful inner team members, wonderful aunts, and superb teachers of this school in the institution which we are here today. Good evening, Father. And greetings to you on behalf of Rotary, our right, President Jennifer Jones, you know, which has created history, Rotary has created history here. This year, after 118 years, we are seeing a woman in place right at the top of our own very organization, which makes us very feel proud. This is the year for women, and that is what we have been talking about, that all of our focus and energy this year of course, you know, we have our energies are to be spread out over all the other areas, but special focus has to be given on upliftment of the young child and on inclusion, more inclusion of the women into Rotary, which is also the focus area which has started like our we used to have a four-way test that everything should follow or whatever we do in life, it, it should follow the four-way test. Now a new mantra has come in that we should it should also follow interest of diversity, equity and inclusion, which means that we need more women in Rotary because we need to be very diverse, we need more youngsters in Rotary. So this is special focus area, besides that we should be reflecting all our members in this year, uh, should be members which should reflect the society. I'm so happy, you know this club, when you come to, you know, you would like to come to clubs like this, honestly. You like to come because the, the, the clubs which follow all these systems, they have been there for years. The commitment of the members, you know, Mahadeva, where is he? He's still around or he's left? Mahadeva, where is he? You're only one and only charter member. I think yeah. you should please stand up and be recognized. <laughs> But I think the strength of this club is that you have people and pillars like him which continue to keep on serving it. And the club follows all the system. You know, Mola and Kacham, first of all, compliments to you. You have given me such two jewels. One Star Walker President and another Star Walker Zone Governor. Both are smiling all the time. Both are always smiling. And they know to say yes means yes only. They even do not speak much. But they are doing, both of them are doing great, wonderful work, you know. Uh, ZG Ghanjam, I must confess, you have been an asset in my team. And we have already recognized, although he was not present there at the conference. He has gone for his son's wedding. Yeah. You know, such lucky pair you have. Both son got married during my tenure. When one is home to one another, is the president. Now if somebody is daughter or son, you want to marry early, take up some senior position. But thank you so much, Gacham, uh, and thank you, uh, Star Walker President. I think both are achievers in their own right. Uh, when I had a nice closed door meeting, and nice club assembly with wonderful club directors and other members, senior members of this club, I think I have said most of the things which I wanted to say. But as a, uh, you know, two or three points, uh, which because it's a larger gathering here, we have some more guests and two new members which we have inducted. Uh, I would say add a few more things. First of all, as I said, you 
to enjoy it coming to this school. I, it's, it's something, uh, I, this is my fourth or fifth visit to this in last about 15, 20 years. Uh, not 20 years, but at least 15 to 16 years. Uh, when I've been active in more active in Rotary, uh, starting with Juby Bhatt's time. In fact, with Juby Bhatt, that was my first meeting. I still remember the kind of great fellowship also we used to have. Eh? Parked up on the terrace, yes. up on the terrace. But uh, more than that, you know why you would like to come? Because you have created a nice temple of service. Thinking of education, thinking of school 40 years ago, which was the necessity, was not a small thing to do. And you built, you thought about, you had a foresight to start a school. I was discussing inside, you know, you have already probably, uh, you know, 20,000 students might have passed out from this school. What a human service you would have done to the society and in one way creating those jewels, you know, 8,000, 8, 20,000 jewels studying, passing out of a rotary school. This is an immense service to the society. I think it must be complimented. All of your hands put together, you know, put your hands for yourself only. This is not a mean, mean achievement, I can tell you. And it is growing. It is going to grow. It is not going to die down the kind of systems which you have built into the club, kind of systems which you have built into the trust. I also must, you know, the compliment your current Dr. Shiv Kumar is not here, the trust chairman is not here. Suresh, the secretary is here. Wonderful thing. And the school president, Gautam Chand. You know, all of you have a secretary, Nimapa, dear Nimapa. We have worked together in the past. When I was the secretary, she was the AG You know, you have built such good systems in place and this is going to live beyond us. You know, this is the duty of every institution builder, every Rotarian that you do things which live beyond you. You don't think only for yourself. You create systems that don't think that you only keep it to yourself. Oh, I have done it, I have done it. You do it for the society, you do it for Rotary, you do it for Rotary 3190, and you do it for Rotary Malavali. I think compliments to all of you. Wonderful. Now I am leaving you with certain thoughts. You know, going through the various Rotary clubs and going to the various schools which Rotary has run it. I think time has come because when I come to schools, I go back to my own childhood. I have very, very great memories of my childhood. You know, I went to a public school when I was very small, when I was in the kindergarten. But as we were growing, there was no school around us, uh, which was beyond class 6 or 7. So in class 8, I had to shift to a school and I shifted to a government school at that time. So next three years, I spent in my government school, but I can tell you, I have so great memories of that school. I still remember the great teachers who taught me. I still remember those names because they laid a new foundation for me. I flourished when I joined a government school, honestly. I took to sports like a fish to water. Before that, we were just playing probably, you know, the uh, marbles or the dividendas or something on the... But where when I joined government school, it was so nicely run school at that time, it will give run for money to a private school. I came into my own. In studies, sports, extracurricular activities, debating, it laid my foundation, but this foundation was laid by two things. First of all, we had a great teachers. And I must compliment the teachers community which is here. We have built this school for you, but you build the future of the nation by teaching these students. I think onus is on you to keep the high flag of Rotary's Malakali School to fly high and see to it your students are among the best, nothing but the best which could be there. And this should be our aim. When we come to a school every day and you go to a classroom, you must say that I am going to create today the best of the students in my class which will represent our country, they will be the best of the students. Now what I still distinctly remember is when I went to class 8 in a government school, I was drawn to spirituality by one of my English teachers. This was a very novel experience for me. You know, coming from a very open background, my, in my home you will find Guru Granth Sahib being there, a 
Christian Bible being there, and also the Ram and Krishna. You know, we had a big temple. My father was, uh, you know, very very liberal. I came from that school with an equal respect for every religion, every caste, because in those days, honestly, I do not, I we never thought about my our caste at all. And somebody who used to talk about the caste, I eliminated my surname from my name itself. My original certificates do not have my surname. Because I didn't believe into it. And this person who laid the foundation for my spirituality was a school teacher in English, Suri Ram Sharma. He brought me to the world of spirituality. He taught me Gita at a very young age of class 8. Now this is where I learned the importance of moral science being taught. There used to be a class of moral science when I was in a private school. But then what this gentleman gave me for the next three years totally transformed my life, my outlook to the society. I think these are the kind of children, I think I, I should be proud to say in the tradition which I was brought on. And I will proud to see every child being brought into that kind of a mode because we are becoming a very, very divisive society. Outside when we go out, when we bring politics in, Politics is only meant to divide people. Trust you me, it is not only in India. It is even outside the world. And nobody is about criticism, but politics totally divide. Rotary is the only organization which unite. And I see a real hope, hope for the society among these teachers when you should give them good values. And probably I was discussing with Elizabeth on the sidelines. We must start a moral class for the students for every rotary school, for every interact we are running. Maybe once a week, once a fortnight, once a month. And I would rather go to an extent, probably we will develop a curriculum. Wherever we are teaching these, our rotary schools are there, let 800 children know what rotary is, what rotary stands for, and what is our four-way test, why we talk of diversity, equity, and inclusion, why we talk of world peace, why we talk of mothers and child being helped? Why we talk of creating economies? Because we are such a neutral organization. We should teach them why UN respects you, United Nations, where you have an extra day. Why US President calls you one day for, to the White House for a special dinner for the top leadership of Rotary because you are doing great work. Why Pope also calls you for you know, this kind of an honor for a meeting with a pope, nobody can be, even a prime minister of a country goes, you know, you have to follow so much protocol. One day he also dedicates to the president meeting with the RA president. Why PM Modi wants to be in I think time has come. This good world of Rotary should spread. And I think together in our own district, we probably are teaching more than 10,000 school, the children who are studying in uh, Rotary schools and maybe we have an equal strength of interact, we should start into the curriculum and my appeal would be probably we could have a training program for the teachers who are teaching in such schools so that they are able to teach you know, what Rotary stands for and what unites the world and where the peace will be. In fact, uh, this, this if we are able to achieve, will be a great achievement. The second thing which I am so glad, you know, the, you have two smiling presidents, but this has a wonderful bunch of all directors and members here. Whatever I was requesting, nobody said no. They said, sir, you have come here, you have asked us. If nobody has asked us before. If you have asked us for TRF, we will give you for TRF. I asked for a very notional contribution of TRF from your trust also, because we are using Rotary name. We are using Rotary name. And we are teaching, doing so good work, but still some surplus is left in our hands. Now that surplus has to be used for the good of the society. Whether you, you are saying do so much good for the, our own children in Mangali, why somebody in other country should not benefit from it? Why somebody in other state, other part of India, other part of the world should not benefit from it? When you get to Rotary Foundation, I can assure you, it is the truest and the most honest giving, most purest giving to the, it's like giving to your own God, you know, each day that we always remember it in the whole world, every morning everybody goes to pray, but when you give to Rotary, you can also understand 
that this will be money which will be rightly utilized because only foundation will be water. One and only I can tell you, which is so transparent, it gets 10 out of 10 scores or 10 scores. The counts from the charity navigator worldwide for the last 13 years, world's best organization because we publish our accounts to everyone. Nothing is hidden there. And every penny actually you give is used 10 percent more, 20 percent more because people like Bharat, me, Hone Goga, Vijay Kumar, all Mohanlal, or Gansham, or Gautam Chand, they all contribute their own strength into it, their own administrative cost in running the projects which is not taken into account. We spend, we do not even account for it, our time. Even time, if I have to account for it, I think end of the year, it will be tens and lakhs of crores of man hours which India spends. If you put even a notional cost of 800 rupees per hour, India itself will be probably be spending almost about 800 crores in terms of man hours which we spend in Rofi, which nobody calculates. But this, if you monetize, add to the cost of the projects, you can imagine how much money the worth of service we do. So that was my final appeal to you. I'm so glad and happy that you all have said yes to it. This is it. Rotary things start by saying yes. Once you make up your mind, I think nobody can stop you. This is power of imagination, and this is our theme this year. Imagine Rotary, and Jennifer says, I think such a very, I think she has given probably one and a half page of speech, but one line which makes and sets it apart is that says, friends, Rotarians, let us imagine our best. Because Imagine your best what you will give to the world. Imagine your best what you will give to yourself. Imagine your best what you will give to your own club. Because this world deserves our best. Nothing but the best. And I am so happy. Manwari is already on path to excellence. Mullah Bhai, you smile at the लेकिन इतनी दूर आए करते करते ये फोटो या अगर आपको अंदर दिखा देते तो मैं शायद उस प्रोजेक्ट के बारे में कुछ और बोल देता बट बोलने की जरूरत नहीं है हमारा काम इतना हैवी है इट्स बॉडी ऑफ वर्क्स एंड योर बॉडी ऑफ वर्क्स स्पीच फॉर इट आई थिंक लेट अस हैव मोर क्लब्स लाइक मनवली मोर प्रेसिडेंट्स लाइक मोहल्ला मोर पास प्रेसिडेंट्स लाइक मनवली है सच ए कोहेसिव क्लब सच you know this camera day in between it, itana bhai chara, itana pyaar aapas me. I think this is the foundation which Rotary has made. Thank you so much. We will keep making. We still have three months to go. Lot to achieve. I am not talking about lot of projects which are coming up. You will be surprised. This morning, I was coming and it's like we have been working on it for the last four months. On 12th of April, we are going to sign a agreement with Bosch, National Skill Development Corporation. I am not aware where we are going to create 1,000 skilled entrepreneurs and create 1 lakh jobs in the next two years. This is going to be our legacy for 3190, which we are going to leave. And one thing which finally I must tell you is, take advantage of Baidu scholarship, which I couldn't tell you inside. I think there are so many schools around. You have a school here. How many schools are in Manwari? How many schools are in Manwari? 36 plus. Six. 46 plus. 46 plus. Now I can tell you, so much opportunity of service uh, the road is going to provide. Have you heard of Baijus scholarship? Baijus is the world's, remember, she knows. How it is good or bad? It's good. It's good. Now if I say I give it to you free, you don't have to even pay for it. Now it is good, better or best to have it? Something when... Baijus wanted to give through CSR the scholarships, they chose Rotary to do it. And they said, Rotarians, you are doing so much good work on Rotary India Literacy Mission. We want to give scholarships worth how many crores? Gautam Chand, can you imagine how much how many crores of scholarship we can distribute? Distribute more. How much Baijus would have said? How much you distribute? Okay, go ahead. I give you something free. I say it is endless. Take as much as you can. How much you will take? Take more and more. More and more? Right. They want to give us 8,000 crores worth of scholarships. All free. 
18,000 rupees is the cost. So 25 children per school will get it. I think first you should start here from this school. But 1,000 rupees per child will be the cost, administrative cost charged by the Rotary India Literacy Mission. Because they are going to follow it up every quarter for three years. All children will progress for the come. So you will pay only 25,000, but you will do a project of 20 lakhs per school. If you have money, spread it to other schools also, but take it, begin here, commit as many as schools you can, how you will be able to spread the name of Rotary doing going beyond your own school and working and, and you know, empowering children. And my suggestion would be, wherever you go, help schools to pick up girl children more than the boys. Of course, there has to be merit behind it, but then we special heart should go to the club children, uh, the girl child, let us do it from the values. So this was the final pitch. I leave it here. Up to you. Keep on doing good work. Our other three months are left. If the need be, if something I'm passing through it, I would again like to come back here and eat your sugar-free sweet, which I didn't eat. So go to my own heart, 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 my